Hello everyone, this is Dr. Apinav. So in this video, I'll be discussing about the UPSC CMS important high yield topics which uh, will yield you additional marks in your exam. So for the subject pediatrics, we'll see. Before we start, if you haven't subscribed to your channel, please do subscribe. And uh, you can also join our telegram group where we'll be having our discussions. The link is in description. So for pediatrics, if you see the topic on milestones is very very important so at least you can expect five questions from this one topic so make sure that uh, you are thorough with this specific topic next is malnutrition breastfeeding uh, normal newborn findings uh, you should be able to differentiate a normal newborn from an abnormal newborn and neonatal resuscitation steps when to start cpr when to uh, give uh, ventilation and those kind of things jaundice and types breast milk jaundice breastfeeding jaundice and uh, other types of uh, conjugate increase in conjugate bilirubin uh, unconjugated bilirubin those uh, genetic disorders and adhd mainly its management seizures from febrile seizure to uh, focal seizure generalized seizure all those things and uh, treatment given micro and macronutrients especially like uh, zinc and uh, other uh, vitamins such as uh, B complex vitamins and uh, anemia is related to it. Diarrhea and its management mainly the ORS treatment, urinary tract infection and uh, inborn errors of metabolism. Just know about uh, the biochemic, biochemical uh, biochemistry uh, tables that you see the inborn errors of metabolism all those diseases is very important and also know about the pneumonia and its management in newborn the important topics for surgery is uh, gastric peptic ulcer disease and gastric cancers variceal bleed and its management mainly you see the surgical shunts types of shunts and a stepwise approach to variceal bleed management pancreatitis and its radiological findings both acute and chronic pancreatitis and a complication of pancreatitis intestinal obstructions colorectal cancer syndromes all those uh, syndromes are very important especially pu jagger syndrome cowden syndrome and uh, just know whether it is autosomal dominant or recessive and the number of polyps involved Hernia and its surgeries, uh, benign prostatic hyperplasia and uh, the surgery and its complication, TURP. Thyroid cancers, mainly know about the men's syndrome in thyroid cancers and uh, different uh, histological findings seen in thyroid cancers. And know about the shock and sepsis guidelines, the updated guidelines. Know about Zenka's diverticulum, neck dissection and the lymph nodes involved, oral cancers and uh, how to treat them staging of oral cancers is also important salivary gland stones kidney stones and its management and uh, pneumothorax and its management mainly know all the updated things about the pneumothorax then coming to obstetrics and gynecology know the postpartum hemorrhage stepwise management and uh, hypertension in pregnancy eclampsia management the pre-chart regime ectopic pregnancy and uh, know all the most commons the questions uh, which start with most common especially in the fallopian tube for example most common site of ectopic pregnancy in fallopian tube most common site of rupture those things and uh, management of ruptured versus unruptured ectopic pregnancy types of abortion and uh, cervical findings whether it is closed to open and uh, pcos and the important criteria and mainly the management in PCOS. Cervical cancers, mainly uh, about the screening of cancers, HPV and the vaccines. Contraceptives is very important both in obstetrics and gynecology as well as in PSM. So uh, learn about it thoroughly. You can definitely have questions from contraceptives. Amenorrhea evaluation both primary and secondary and uh, infertility. So all of the newer modalities and uh, newer treatment options in infertility and mainly the 
sperm sperm analysis findings who findings and the abnormal findings in it and molar pregnancy gestational neoplasm trophoblastic neoplasms the partial mole complete mole differences physiological changes in pregnancy antiphospholipid antibody syndrome pelvic inflammatory disease and uh, basic antenatal checkup coming to psm so know about the types of studies the epidemiological study case control study cohort study ecological study all those things know how to identify them in a, a case based question and national immunization schedule vaccines health indicators know about the health indicators this is very important and know about the indian healthcare system the asha primary healthcare center sub center those things know about the nutritional requirement both in children pregnant ladies and lactating females know about the health programs important such as tb malaria blindness and non communicable diseases mainly the cardiovascular disease uh, health programs and its guidelines know about covid 19 so in the past we might have had uh, one or two questions in covid 19 but now we may expect a lot of questions and a recent neat pg also had a lot of questions in from covid 19 so we expect to have lots of covid 19 questions in the upcoming exam disaster management population pyramid types uh, vector borne diseases most important so know which vector will cause which disease the microbiology things that is very important and mainly the rickett cell pox kind of diseases all those rickett cell diseases is very important know the sensitivity and specificity uh, how to find a find sensitivity and specificity of a disease know about mean median and mode and uh, how to solve the question uh, mathematical questions based on this learn about the types of prevention primary secondary tertiary primordial and know about the internet international health agencies uh, where the headquarters of international health agencies is located and uh, mostly the programs that they are sponsoring then other important topics or uh, topics such as cranial nerves know about the cranial nerves and uh, what are the findings that can be seen in cranial nerve for example they may give a case and ask you to localize which cranial nerve or they can ask you which syndrome uh, stroke syndrome that will involve these cranial nerves and in physiology the pain fibers alpha delta and uh, a fiber b fiber c fiber those kind of questions are very important now about rheumatological drugs that demarts and uh, glaucoma cataract questions are often seen in this exam now about otitis media and nasopharyngeal carcinoma and uh, spinal epidural anesthesia what layers are being pierced schizophrenia osteoarthritis rheumatoid arthritis and gouty arthritis in uh, ent and opta uh, please note down the important topics and uh, read them because most uh, we are we have seen most most of the questions uh, apart from the top uh, apart from the given five subjects uh, are from ent and opta so ent basically know about meniere's disease osteosclerosis and uh, the basic anatomy of uh, ears and uh, in opta know about the type of conjunctivitis cataract glaucoma as said before and uh, both for ent and opta know the most common causes for example you should know the most common cause of otitis in, uh, media otitis externa and most common cause of uh, viral conjunctivitis all those things you will have to know so that's all if you haven't subscribed please please do subscribe and uh, you can also join our telegram group the link is in description thank you